Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another video, and today I'll be doing a little quick line of sight flight with uh, my ZMR X210 here. And I'll just give you a quick rundown on the specs. Um, I'm using DAL T5040 V2 props, um, tri blades obviously, and I do have some HQ ones, um, which are actually my favorite, but as you can see, I've been chipping them up. Uh, where was the other one? And over here, I've, I've had some chips in them, so they're kind of off balance, so I need to get a couple more sets of them. So. These are the next best thing in the props I have. I've got the Emax 2205-2300 kV red bottoms on there with some little B20 amps. I've got the X-Razor F303 in there. I've got a Turnigy, um Graphene 1.3 amp uh, 65C. So, you know, pretty good battery. A little heavy. I um, have the Dragonfly VTX in there with a TBS Triumph antenna, but that's not that important since we're going to be flying line of sight today and the uh, ZMR X210 configured in the lightest version without the bottom plate and my run cam 2 strapped on here. So uh, yeah, basically on the ESCs I'm running a BL Heli 14.6 and on the flight controller I'm running the newest beta flight which at this video is 2.8.1 which I just flashed last night and I did a quick little tuning session. I don't know if you can see over there on my uh, laptop I've just been tuning the last two batteries and I've got it pretty pretty close to what it should be, so it should be good enough for the line of sight. And I will include some run cam video, so let's get the camera on my head and the radio going, and we'll see how it goes. Okay, so let's just put the uh, quad down here. I'll just start it here so we have a level surface to start off from, and I'll get my radio on. Get it over the camera there. Oops, flip the switch. Okay, and now I'm running, um, like I said, uh, I didn't say this, but I'm running 250 loop time of 4,000 hertz, so no auto leveling is even possible, even if you set it up. So I fly full acro now in line of sight. I do apologize for any wind. I've been trying to get a calmer day, but about the best I've got so far. So let's just start my timer. I'll just keep it to about a three minute flight to try and be a little easier on my batteries here. So I'll just do a quick hover test for you guys. Like I said, it is getting quite windy. As you can see it hovers no problem at all. Got a fairly decent tune on there. That is the yaw rate I have set in. And then I'm in full acro, so as you can see, hopefully, I can't really do it with my neck strap, but uh, there is no self-leveling. I've got pretty high rates with pretty high expo in there. So once again, full acro, as you can see there. Okay, well our battery is full, let's do some uh, throttle punch here. You can see pretty good. I'm running a 4S graphene on there. Now let's do some speed test. Full speed against the wind. So let's try with the wind here. It's coming at it sort of an angle. Probably 60 against the wind and 70 with it. That's a battery buster right there. That's amazing. You can see this thing just rips. I do have a damp light or ESC braking enabled. With it, with it not on, I've once I turned it on, it just blew me away how much different it felt. So let's do some what I call stupid. Go towards the ground. All right, let me just land for a second here. I can see I got one minute, so let me turn on my run cam. And I have the cameras at a 25 degree tilt. Tilt. That's what the mounts come with. Probably would like a 30 because I'm flying yesterday. I was just maxing this thing out uh, full speed, and I probably want a 30. So let's just start a little footage. Okay, there we go. It's recording. So I'll arm my motors. And start my timer. Let's just get a little footage. Just keep flying a little bit. And if you haven't seen, I do have uh, quite a few FPV videos already. If you haven't uh, seen them, I'll leave some links down below. Now, I am fairly new to acro line of sight flying. 
so I apologize for anything, but, uh, it's a lot more fun than, uh, flying in rate or angle mode, I think. My battery's getting a little low here. Alright, and these graphenes, it might not sound like it, but, uh, they hold out full power until the very end, so... You have to be kind of careful and run a timer with them. Alright. Let's bring her back in. And I'll show you the, how strong the ESC braking is. Ready? Instantly it's just done. So let's switch off my timer, stop the recording. So there we go. That was my quick little flight, um, line of sight flight with my ZMR X210. Pretty powerful little machine. I'm uh, pretty happy with it right now. Frame could be improved a little bit, um, but you know, motors ESC, they're tested and proven, and props are working out pretty well as well as the battery. So, you know, looks good overall. And that was the end of the video. I've got more FPV videos down below, and definitely a lot more coming on this one. Uh, my motors feel a little bit warmer than I'd like. They're not hot, they definitely are warm. And it is a, it's not that hot of a day, probably 80 out right now, so I might have to check my tuning a little. Um, and my battery's just warm, but no problem at all there. Pretty hard pushing it there. So, you know, that was the flight. Please subscribe if you weren't already, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.